let's see where this adventure takes us. <laughs> I'm staying late tonight, folks! <laughs> I hate this GPS, it's so finicky. I gotta move around for like 10 seconds before it stops spazzing out and actually tells me which way I'm facing. Chuckalaka boom chuckle. Boom chuckalaka boom chuckalaka boom. Boom chuckalaka boom chuckalaka boom. I'm gonna go over this curb. Over the curb. Boom chuckalaka boom chuckalaka boom chuckalaka boom chuckalaka boom chuckalaka. I'm making a bunch of clips with the camera sitting on the dashboard right now. I'm hoping that it's going to have a decent view. I mean, with a wide angle camera, you're always going to have a pretty damn good view regardless of where it's positioned. So I'm hoping it's not going to matter because I can't exactly watch any of these stupid videos. There's no screen on this GoPro. It's the GoPro Hero Session. It's just a stupid little cube. So I can't exactly watch the videos on it. Yeah, sure, I could connect it to my phone and watch the videos wirelessly, but you know what? That would be that would just defeat the whole purpose of bringing the damn GoPro because I have to use my phone for the damn GPS so I know where I'm going. So I'll watch the videos when I get home and just hope that you can see the road and see where I'm going or at least see part of the damn road. We'll have to see, folks. But if it doesn't show what I'm hoping it's showing, then you're just watching a stupid video of basically me talking. Ooh Ooh this road, I believe like a bit further behind me though, was the road that I got into my motorcycle accident on. Yep, pisses me off. It really pisses me off. Okay, I hate going down this road because it always reminds me of that day where I almost died. Why did I almost die? Because I was not wearing any protective gear at all whatsoever. I was literally just wearing sport shorts and a shirt. And I don't know how I was able to walk away from it because I didn't get hurt at all. I don't know how, that's... I have somebody watching me above. That's for sure. So, thank you for giving me a second chance at life. Does this mean I'm gonna stop riding motorcycles? No. But does it mean I'm gonna have some common sense and play it safe and wear my gear from now on, including a helmet? Yes. Ah, uh, yeah. I'm not gonna just throw my second chance at life away. I wanna make the best of it. I could be dead right now. And then you wouldn't be watching this video, but luckily, somebody above is watching me, and I have continued my life despite this crazy incident. Stupid Prius, stupid hippie potheads. I need more water. You hear that, folks? That is the sound of an empty cup. I need another drink. Oh. I get dehydrated quicker than normal people because I'm obviously not normal, not to mention my gut problems. I expel water from my body a lot more than regular people. It's mostly because of my malnourishment and my diarrhea and all that crap. But hey, water makes me feel better. Until I can figure out how to get rid of my bowel problems, so I can stop having diarrhea. I mean, I don't have diarrhea constantly, but I'm saying the times I do go to the bathroom, it's almost always diarrhea. Too much information. The only times that I'm going to the bathroom like every 20 or 30 minutes is if I eat something with gluten in it, or if I have like a bunch of dairy, 
like a bunch of milk or something like that then usually that'll make me feel more rumbly and make me go piss out my ass more it's cold and humid everyone's exhaust pipes are steamy <laughs> Close enough to my destination. See you folks. Yeah.